What's up, everybody? It is Fighting Wombat here, returning for uh, the final episode. So, right now, for The Wizarding World in Review. My name is Jelani, I'm joined by Collier today. So, <laughs> alright, that was a weird one. <laughs> and we, we're weird. here for Fantastic Beast in the Crown of Grindelwald. We reached our goal, Collier. Huzzah. Woo. Uh, so yeah, just some quick stats real quick before we get into the actual review portion. We do review, um, some fun facts and everything. Don't have a lot of trivia for the movie as it's been out for maybe two days at this point. <laughs> 48 but, hours. Yeah, so, you know, total run time of the entire Wizarding World, including this movie, about 22 hours. It's a little bit under, but I round up. Uh, production budget of just the, not this one because they haven't revealed it yet, uh, for the entire thing. Up to Fantastic Beasts at least. Hmm. Well, the first one. It's really confusing now. They all call it Fantastic Beasts. Um, <laughs> 1.58 billion. Total gross income. Not including this one because it's not made all the money it can. But currently, I'm guessing. Yeah. Well, not currently because this one is not counting any money this thing's made already. Oh, okay. 8.437 billion dollars. So, yeah. They made money on this. Not sure if you know that. So, not. <laughs> it's a lot of money. <laughs> Yeah, all right. So, uh. You okay? Those numbers are huge. That's some big numbers. Can't even count that high. <laughs> <laughs> so. So, I how, this one. How, how, here's how we're going to do this, right? How we're going to do this? We're going to start off kind of a non spoiler section. So, mm -hmm. later on in the video, we will get to spoilers and we'll tell you when we're about to hit spoilers. But right now, we're just going to do some. Some light nice coverage light. of the movie, not spoilery impressions, recommend to go see it or not, and then we're going to hit hard spoilers when we start talking about certain things. Yeah, so like right now, like imagine a cupcake, if you will. The cupcake portion, that's the spoilers. Right now, we got the frosting, we got the sprinkles, and a little plastic decoration. I don't know, it could be like a little, so, a little rainbow thing here's or the whatever, thing. whatever you take. Enjoy the frosting. Here we go. JK needs help writing these movies. She needs help writing them. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> wait, I, wait. That's what you're starting off with? It's not a spoiler. It's just a broad overture. She needs help writing these movies. <laughs> so okay. I'm not going. Point, be, we're not going to be by beat for this one because it's been out. The point is where you go watch it. She could write a book. She can write a book. But she can't write a movie. Well, even when came, even when it came even when it came to the books, you call it screenplay. Even when it came to the books, what she needs at least the, with like someone over show like editing her. Mm -hmm. Because, like, when you went to the books, they went like this, and then they went this, and then this, and this, and this, and this. It's like, like even though Deadly Hollows, there's like, there's some stuff you could have cut out of that book. And in here, there's some stuff you could cut out of this movie, and it would be better It would better probably be a it. whole lot thinner book. I mean, yeah, but it also be probably, just leave it e in book. probably easier to read, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she needs help writing these screenplays. I'm not sure what's happening here. It's like, I. Unless this, she is getting the help, and this, they're just okaying it. It's the. He, I, I know, but. She, she doesn't. No, no. She's the only person with writing credit at all on these movies. But she's the only person writing these. Okay. Yeah. She needs. Yeah, yeah. She needs to call her old friend, and I think it was Steve Knowles, who's the owner of the other Harry Potter movies. Like, yeah, call him, please. Just get him back. Gone with the Fire, right? No, all of them. Oh. I, think, I think he only didn't write one of them. I think that's where the Phoenix too. But I digress. Uh, I can't remember. Go back and watch the videos. You'll hear the name. <laughs> uh. So I've been holding in my burps. For you. Yeah. And here you go. Yeah, but mine's a normal burp. Mine's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. There it is. So, Carl, what's your general impression on the movie? I'm pretty sure who will figure out mine. <laughs> I'm quit. I didn't like it. Spoiler. I'm, I share my opinion with one kid in the audience who just said, hurts. <laughs> just out loud. I hate this movie. Excellent. Cool. It was so funny too. Like, right when everything just settles, just it was a it quiet, was quiet moment. After, like, okay, so okay. after a big moment, it had a quiet moment. It was like, I hate this movie. It was great. You remember that moment in Star Wars, uh, The Last Jedi? Oh, I, I, I also that freaking hyperspace, my... like, and it was just like dead silent. Don't don't bring up The Last Jedi on the internet, Collier. That's how you start a flame war. <laughs> no, no, I'm just saying, like, remember that silence in the movie theater? Like, if you was at the movie theater when you watched it, just that silence, like. I hate this movie. That's literally what happened. 
it was so well, hard to contain my laugh. But yeah, also, we, we uh, like, you know, to like, answer we, your question that you asked like yes. five minutes ago. Yeah, I'm still waiting for the answer. <laughs> still waiting for the answer. You're waiting. You're waiting. Um, still waiting. <laughs> even with this floss, I find it somewhat enjoyable. Right now, it has. At least I am admitting that it does have some very, very glaring issues. <laughs> It yeah, has, right it, now it, it has a forty percent on Rotten Tomatoes for critic score, a seventy three percent audience score. Okay, I, I never understood the whole Rotten Tomatoes. Okay, Rotten so Tomatoes. Okay, here's how it works. There are certain there are critics. They're not saying it's a four out of ten. It's saying forty percent of critics enjoyed it. So that means sixty percent did not. It's just a math thing. So oh uh, okay, because I'm so, thinking like forty percent of the audience threw Rotten Tomatoes at this movie. No. What? It's like forty percent. Like forty percent. No, 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 rotten no, no, no. Good. You know, you no, throw no, no. A, a rotten tomato at something that you don't like. No, see you. Th- That's the impression I've always been getting from no, no. rotten tomatoes. Like, oh, this thing is eighty-five percent on rotten tomatoes. This movie is bad. No, no, no. Eighty-five percent would be well. A majority of critics like the movie. They would recommend the movie. They're not. It's not a score. It's just like the recommendation or not. So uh, I'm basically just like out of a hundred or like out of whatever I mean, pers- people who yeah. saw it. Everything got a hundred percent, but yes, well, well, yeah. it's a percentage. <laughs> that's how that works. So yeah, that's how that that is. Um, okay. Yeah, man. I mean, Newt's back and he's still Newt. And <laughs> I wonder who would win in a battle. I wonder who would win in a staring contest between him and Matt Murdock. Matt probably. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> um, Ever yeah. since you pointed it out. Ever since you pointed he, it out. I it, it's become much more noticeable and apparent like, wow, he's just not stare, looking at anyone at all. <laughs> like <laughs> it's literally like the moment someone approaches him is like I mean, what do you think of Johnny Depp in the movie? He really he, he was. He doesn't really have like anything like big going I, he, for for me. Like sports. I've seen I've seen a little bit of Pirates of the Caribbean. I'm guessing he did good in that or excellent in that. But I know him more in freaking uh Sweeney Todd, uh, Edward Scissorhands. And, you get little stuff in those big franchises he's been in. <laughs> the, the little stuff. That's the major franchise that people know him for. The little stuff. I I, <laughs> I, Sorry, I couldn't what? get I couldn't get into pirates. How did he? The first one was amazing. Then they had the other four happen. <laughs> then I'm guessing that there was just being a dead horse at that point. I was hoping, right? I mean, listen, that horse kept making money, so yeah, that's what they did. Um, I thought he was present for the movie. I guess present. he was there. Yeah, man. I, Jude Law's a good young Dumbledore. At all, I actually that. did forget that it was Johnny Depp playing Grindelwald at all. So right, cool. you know what? Yeah, I, I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed his performance because I forgot it was him. I was like, Grindelwald, Grindelwald. I mean, you also, just, you also just said you really don't know Johnny Depp that well, dude. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, like, like, seeing him. So, I mean, as I'm that. not sure if that's a good thing. Like, you just say you don't know him. So, like, I forgot don't he was know, Don't like, know him much. Like, but I, I went into the movies, like, all right. All right, Carly, you know what I'm saying? You don't know him much. So, it's not unusual for you to forget that character person because you don't know him. <laughs> yeah. So, I, I guess his performance was good. I, I think you're miss, missing what I'm saying, but we're going to move on because we have our time constraints. Because I don't have time to explain this to you about how you, what you just said contradicted yourself. But I digress. So I'm saying Jude Law. I say good young Dumbledore. You know who Jude Law is? Nope. Yeah, cool. He was really he played Dumbledore in the movie. Well, you just said that, but I don't know him from any other. Story. I know. I'm just saying, played a good Dumbledore. Like I can just like yeah, I see that. I don't know how he's going to look over and look like that to Michael Gambon in the next ten years, but yeah. Ten. Remember Michael Gambon. When he picks up Voldemort, it's like 10 years after the, the events of this movie now. So, yeah. Because Voldemort's already born at this point. Oh. Remember, he was going to be born a few weeks after the event, the end of Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. And this one, says, they say six months later, they've... Spoilers. Three months. <laughs> no, Whoa. six. They've... The United States Ministry of Magic, thank you for changing the name. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, that's title card. Did you hear me say thank you? I heard you. I heard you. <laughs> what was it before? I don't know. But it wasn't that. It was something hor- Collier. I, I, oh Christ. Anyway, <laughs> they changed the name. They mm-hmm. retconned a lot. That's what we're with. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they said they had him, the Grindelwald, for six months. 
and then they're going to transfer him to England to do his for crimes. And then after that, it cuts three months later. So that's okay. nine months. It's been, okay. it's been okay. a year. But anyway. So yeah, that means things happen. A lot of things just kind of all over the place. So like yeah. an obscure yeah. Like apparition. I, uh, well, should we get the spoilers? No? No. Okay, cool. Yeah. I'm just saying, how long have you recorded this for? We've been here for 10 minutes. 10? That's what the audio says. <laughs> Does it even feel like 10 yet? It's like we just got here. That's the problem for our videos. We feel like it's not that long. We look when I record, it's like, wow, we were here for an hour. Ah, GB Guinness. Um, okay, 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 okay. Uh, let's see. What else? Okay, um, there's a lot of, you know, we wish I was like on the car ride back home. Some characters didn't need a return, but hey, they were. They, yeah, you get some. You get all the. I, I look, yeah, all the main characters you got from the last one. You can tell that from the also in the trailer too, so it's not a spoiler. And you just kind of yeah. They do a lot of Easter egg stuff in there that's also unnecessary, like. That oh hey we're still cool is he? Like, he it's looks, still he, connected. He, he's Nagini. Uh, you see Nicholas from Mail. What? Oh yeah, he's old. And yeah, that dude was. Here's Hogwarts again, and here's. Ho <laughs> <laughs> you would like to mention your magic? I hope you do, because you spend a lot of time. <laughs> here's the ministry. Man, these guys have been haggling Dumbledore, but it seems like forever. Spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! We might say we should cut to the spoilers because I know it's hard for you not to talk about them. <laughs> yeah, but like. But All are right, we done okay, talking about okay. the general okay. stuff though? So would you recommend people go see this movie? We're gonna cut to the we're gonna cut the spoilers after this. Do you recommend people go see this movie? Yeah. Okay. I'm a hard no. Don't go see this movie. If it it is a visual spectac spectacular. Cool. It looks great. It, it sounds yeah. good. Mm. Beasts and creatures are good. The cat dragon thing is awesome. That's uh, then there's like the uh -oh. Ladies and gentlemen, of course, here's where my argument stands. If you, like I am, are a fan of Star Wars, and you uh, watched the original trilogy, and like, you know what, that was good stuff, and you watched the prequels, and you felt, wow, what happened? That's your feeling on Fantastic Beasts. That's, that's my feeling. And, yeah, we're two down, and we got three more of these things to go. First of all, supposed to be five. So, JK, I know you watch the show. Big fan. Also, if you, 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 JK, you still need to reply to his tweet, though. Yeah, I still need to. I need you to get some help writing these next ones. Let's give it to a screenwriter friend of yours. I know you got him in Hollywood. You're a big producer now. No, uh, hey, maybe, maybe he's doing this. maybe he's doing a repeat of like she, you know Sorcerer's Stone. She. No, maybe these movies are oh, doing okay. the same repeat. But you said he. But I digress. <laughs> Maybe these movies yeah. are doing the same repeat as Sorcerer's Stone and King of Secrets. Slow and just like but here's the thing. up in the air. And I, can the third en one? I can enjoy Sorcerer's Stone. Can you? Yeah. I can enjoy Sorcerer's Stone. I, I don't. There are parts that are like, yeah, that was good. In fact, as I was like, there's nothing here. I mean, <laughs> there's nothing here at all. I, I, the, Sorcerer's Stone has a solid script that has a solid line of up. Here's where it starts and here's where it ends. Fantastic Beast is like, man! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which one? Both? The first one. If you're doing comparison of Fantastic Beasts, Sorcerer's Stone, and also source in, in First Sorcerer's Stone, there is a sense of magic and glee in this site. This is a interesting world. Fantastic Beasts is bland, it's New York, and they have this stupid thing called no magis. <laughs> it's like, this, everything about that fantasy is the most uncreative thing I have seen in a very long while. This is like me watching The Hobbit. <laughs> All of them. The last two were cool. No, last... Don't you dare sit sit there and look at me in the eye. You better do your new Scamander right now and not look at me. Tell me the Hobbit <laughs> movies are good. New Christ. <laughs> I mean, like, this is looking a smell. Bad. You don't like Benedict Cumberbatch as... I love Benedict Cumberbatch. My you problem with that movie that it ends on, like, oh, this is not the end of anything. There was no resolution to that movie. Hey, when you see how this ends, go watch the next movie. Oh, guess what? It There's is. no... Yeah. <laughs> it's ten minutes into the next one. Like, why can't you just put that at the end of the last one? Have a, any sort of resolution. Nah. It was just a lot of nothing. The Hobbit's a children's book. 
He said, 300 pages long. He tried to put into three movies. Battle of Five Armies, guess what? It's 12 pages in the book. That's an entire two hour and a half hour movie, Collier. Why? Because it's in. No! Chris. <laughs> now you got me on that one. Anyway. <laughs> so. So. You guys ready for the main cupcake? Right, cool. Are you We're guys finished with frosting and sprinkles? We're going to spoilers. Right. Also, if you're done with the frosting on a cupcake, you're pretty much done with the cake. No one cares about the other stuff. Then. Anyway, right. so yeah, we're going to spoilers now. All right, spoilers! Put a big, flashing, bright... I've already said it, spoilers. So, Nagini, right? Nagini has absolutely nothing to do with this movie. She does nothing. No, she's just like... She's there. She's... This is... I, I'm, a, I'm so weird I'm tired look. of this. I'm tired of this in Hollywood. These Asian female characters who... They're just there to look hot, and that's it. It's like, give her something to do, or don't have her in the movie. <laughs> it's like, what? She was there to look pretty, and just be there. And it's like, I guess she did her job. But it's like, why was Nagini here at all? Because it's supposed to be freaking Creed. He's like, oh, what, what, oh, look, look, see? More stuff, more stuff connecting to the other one. Remember that? Remember the guinea? She's one more snake. But now she's an Asian person who does nothing. <laughs> cool. Here's Nicholas Flamel. Guess what? You see what does in that cupboard? It's a Sorcerer's Stone. That's how it's immortal. Fucking dope, right? Let's give him a scene at the end. Help him save the day. The old man who had to jog across the room and took longer than walking for most people had to go across Paris to save the day. Why? Because Nicholas Flamel. That's why. <laughs> because it connects to Harry Potter. <laughs> she can't sit color. She can't do that. She can't say these aren't prequels and then do all that. She, I, I, you, you can't. You can't sit there and tell me they're not prequels. No, they're their own story and then connect them in literally every way you could. <laughs> if I swear to God, if we see a baby Voldemort in the next movie, I'm, I'm not watching any more of these. I, I could have swore. Christ. <laughs> I could have swore we were going, uh, going to see like a baby Voldemort. You know what really saddens me about this movie? You want you actually wanted this one to be good, didn't I you? Want all, I want all of your movies to be good. I want all movies to be good. But what Queenie and I forget his name now, Jacob. Yeah. They were, but their, this, their, their this, chemistry this, was my favorite, one of my favorite parts about the movie. Yeah. Thing. And this and one, then, it was just annoying. Yeah. Why are they here? Why is any of this happening? They spent the entire movie looking for each other. Well, not, but, but they showed up, she jinxed them apparently, which is a huge, like, not only can you mind me, you're gonna jinx someone into doing what you want, that's a huge mistrust. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. We can't be together at that moment. But it's like, then she runs off, and then it's like, alright, cool. That's why he has to go to Paris. It's like, but why is any of this happening? This whole, the whole love thing that these characters all have for each other, I guess, it's like, it slowed the movie down to a grinding halt. It's okay, like, you know what they, really slowed the movie to a grinding halt? <laughs> What? Going to the strangest, whatever that was, and then they had that new in freaking Tina, Tina. I call it. It was like, how did you slam on the brakes going five miles per hour? <laughs> I don't understand this. Was it's it like, even like? It's just like it was really slow. And then it's like, and then it's oh, like, very cool. We have to have this scene. It's like, sir, if you don't just say, I'm not engaged to her. Your your eyes in the, in the paper. It's something. Call you, I know you saw me lean further down in my chair. It's like, oh my fucking god, if we don't get to this point. Okay, you know what? And me, also, okay, okay. me, you, and the guy next to me. The guy next to me just, had the same. Both, we, we, both of us were like, ah, oh, and he was like, ah. Oh. Just come. <laughs> I'm just like, come the fuck on, dude. Come the fuck on. That's something you can cut. Just cut, cut all the love stuff out of this thing, the whole love. That's not even triangles, really. It's just a normal relationship you have with people. Just cut that stuff out, and you have I, saved thirty. No, okay, no, saved this whole maybe love thirty thing to was so forty minutes of this movie. <laughs> this love thing was so irrelevant to me. Like it was relevant to the movie as well. <laughs> I forgot that something was happening between Newt and uh, what's her face? Tina. Tina. No, not Tina. The the other one that, oh, he, that he thought that Lita Lestrange. Yeah, her. I forgot that she, I'm guessing that she was thinking that he was doing a thing with her. Yeah, because but the, the magazine, the, brother, the, the magazine screwed up. That's what they said. That's their whole emotion during the magazine screw up. That I, I, I uh, that she was that she thought that he went and got engaged Lilo Strange, and that his brother was his best man. No, his brother, who I can't remember his name, so that's how relevant that character is. <laughs> I, I, I don't remember his, 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 his brother is marrying Lilo Strange, and Newt's the best man, which also, bro. That's a fucked up bro move. 
Bruh, 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 bruh. Also, also, okay. Bye, good. Okay, so in, in, the, in the beginning of the movie, when so. we meet the brother for the first time, and they got the room out there, there's like, oh, we'll, you know, give you your, what you call it, back to travel the States if you, you know, help us. And he's like, no, and you storm him out. And then the brother came, and it's like, giving him a hug, and it was like, just, just a limp. Then like, yeah. So, I'm, I'm guessing this is how, okay, okay, hold the phone. Pause. So, yeah, where were we? Fucking love, whatever. Stupid. Love triangle and the freaking way how he treated his brother with a weird hug. And then at the end, well, of the I mean, movie, his he brother's gets... warning him like, "Hey, they're watching you." By the way, he said, "You know that." So. I, th- I thought he said that he was watching him. No, he said they're watching you. Oh, that's said... that, because that's the whole thing. Remember the guy was following Newt, and then yeah. that was the end of them following him, I guess. Yeah. Then he was able to illegally exit the country. It's like, were they following you? What happened? I guess they are just kind of done with that. Excellent. Yeah. Because you said no, you don't have permission, and then just not done that. <laughs> Also, when uh, Dumbledore and Newt went on that bus, and then Dumbledore left, mm-hmm. I thought it was going to be one of those magical 14-decker bus that yeah. Harry Potter just, just... was in, and then that thing was just going to yeah. fucking take off. That's just a normal bus. Yeah, just a normal bus. There. And also, okay, just so... freaking apparating in... Hey! I, the I, I guess, I guess in the, the rules are a little bit more lax about doing magic in the real world, because in Harry Potter, it's a little bit more... Well, then again, but it rules are... Huh? What's going on with the audio? Uh, yeah. It's still going, right? Yes, it's still going. All right, so your computer is just... For some reason, yeah, it is. I ain't running anything else. All right, there we go. That's, okay. That was weird. I hope that's not fucked up. Uh, <laughs> anyway, so... So I'm guessing the, the rules are a whole lot more lax in London. You know what else like... is lax in this about the rules? What apparition looks like. Because they apparate two separate ways in there. There are two okay, different yeah. versions. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, okay. But now... It, 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 not it, not only in the first movie, in this film, in this one, it looks different <laughs> later on in the film. It's like... Where's the consistency here? Okay, but also... I gotta and also, say, what, what's I, the whole little thing that they like, like... It just smoked. That, that was your operating. That, the, huh? That's what he said. It was operating. It's like, but that's... But we saw what it looked like, and that's not it. Yeah, it, it's like... <laughs> yeah. And gone. But that's not what it looked like there. It's like... Because they have to look like Death Eaters, because they're a precursor, remember? That's why. Mm, that's what it was. Yeah. And also... Oh, uh, See, freaking... Connection, what, connection, what, connection. Also, <laughs> what, also uh, freaking... Oh, Grindelwald's calling his followers. Yeah, it's just... The most non The most non-subtle thing ever. <laughs> I mean, like, like... You said even Voldemort's... What, I mean, but yeah, Voldemort's was in the sky, though, and it was one thing. It didn't cover your house. <laughs> it didn't go all... It didn't cover the so, so So was the sheets them, or is it just like... A, a, I guess it was... I don't know. I have no clue what it was, Collier. Okay, also, so that first scene, when, they're, when Grindelwald breaks out, well, very obvious because it's not him. He's like, you didn't cut out this time because you didn't catch anything up to him, have him not talk. <laughs> that's how I knew that. I was like, yeah, that's that's right. We found we we found his wand. It's like, okay, well, yeah, he's already out and he's going to do this because you you wouldn't bring the wand to the evil wizard there. It's like, you wouldn't transfer that with him. Absolutely not. That would have been in Europe a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, that, that would, if, and this too. This thing. It's like. This now there's a MacGuffin. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> was, this already about the Deathly Hallows. Why do we have to have another MacGuffin? <laughs> but okay, so that first scene, when the fighting is happening, okay. could you not see anything? I couldn't see shit. Okay, I was like, it's dark and I can't see anything. I was like, I'm looking at, I'm just looking at, but you're in there flash, 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 flash. It's, like, it's like it's dark. There's a flash. It's dark. There's a flash. It's like, oh, fucking. I, I, I was thinking at you, David Yates again. I was like, God. <laughs> I can't see the screen. <laughs> Not showing me anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was like, huh? <sighs> okay. So yeah. What it, it? At least freaking what was it? Uh, Half Blood Prince or Order of Phoenix when they had to transport Harry through the whole thing. That was tolerable. That looked a whole lot better. Yeah, well, there's no flashing, too, so it's like, it's not trying to get your fucking epilepsy <laughs> while the movie isn't going on. Oh, man. So, yeah. That was a thing. Yeah, that, that was a boy. Yeah, so I thought, Johnny, I thought Johnny Depp was like, like I said, I thought it was there, I mean, I don't know, it's like, I was like, man, he's been so much cooler with Colin Farrell instead of Johnny Depp still. Who? Colin Farrell, the guy who was... He was impersonating in the first film. Uh, oh, him, yeah. 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 I was like, no, man. actually, actually could have. I was like, I was like, yeah, it's would still been better with Colin Farrell. <laughs> I mean, he would. I would say this: it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Mm-hmm. 
But also, it's like, it didn't really rise anywhere. It just kind of like, no, he remained on the nice neutral. Also, Crimes of Grindelwald, not a lot of crime. Not a lot of crimes in here. You, you think that it's like, all right, he's going to see some crime. He's going to do some crimes. Or he's going, they're going to have a trial about it. No trial. And just kind of acts. I mean, other people kill for him, but he's not doing the killing. I mean, so, yeah, it's like, where, where are the crimes? Where are the crimes of Grindelwald here? Oh, listen, honestly... We saw more crimes of Grindelwald in the beginning, the first minute of the last movie when he obliterated everyone. What's wrong with you? I'm sorry, there's like absolutely nothing about... The... Oh, okay, that's what you do. I was like, yeah, because you kept doing it. So I, thought, I was like, is this a bit? <laughs> or is he actually looking for something? No, there, there was like... <laughs> I was like, what happened? No, it, it was a bit to what you were saying. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it was like, no. I was literally looking for like, okay, so he's going to be doing... He's going to be Grindelwald... Doing Grindelwald things that he's known. I mean, I for. guess he did kill people at the end there, but it's like he only wait. Okay, wait. but also did I he say, kill anyone? Yeah, the the flames. The, the flames were killing people. If you weren't, you, it, I okay, guess okay, if yeah, you weren't then, deemed then. worthy, that they would kill you. If what you weren't deemed worthy of it. Yeah, like, I mean, like, one of the kills on his side gets burned alive. So I guess I don't yeah. know. Yeah, it's like all right, and and oh man, I, I have no clue. That's for some reason, I, his first kill in the entire movie was. Oh, wait, no, 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 because he, okay, he was no, zapping he, guys he, off the carry. I guess he could kill people then, there, but it's like, a lot of not, a lot of not else happening in that movie, bro. <laughs> the lizard. That kind of broke my heart a little like, bit. Also, where was that lizard in the earlier movie? They caught his pet lizard, and it was with him. I don't know. I have Why no. did they bring the lizard? To show how heartless Sir, he is? Or, or I have, towards I have like, no clue. It's okay, the it's okay, was. it's okay. So needy. Out, out the chariot you go. Also, the, he's not even consistent in his own rules. He said, we're not heartless. This little kid, he's going to kill him. It's like, sir, you said it two minutes ago that you're not heartless. <laughs> kill a little kid. He's not heartless. They are. He didn't give them the word. They they just acted. He didn't. He sure as hell didn't feel anything about it. He's like, all right. <laughs> just kept going. No repercussion for that. <laughs> I, the movie gets bogged down because they just move forward with the story. If the story's going to focus around Newt, then have it focus around Newt. Don't have it focus around Newt and all his friends who don't really need to be there because you didn't have, you gave Jacob something to do that wasn't really necessary for anything else. And like, obviously, I was like, Queen, of course Queen's going to trade sides because she doesn't like the rules. Of course. Oh well, yeah, that's right. The, the that's aren't the same in London, so I'm like, but I was like, like, they can just move to London and solve all these problems. You like, oh, you got to be registered. It's like, then get citizenship. Yeah. Getting citizenship in London is not as hard as getting citizenship. <laughs> yeah. Like, like, you can do this. There are other places you can go. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like, it's like, this is a non-issue that they make into a big thing in this movie. And also, was another big issue too? How freaking Jacob remembers. Just us. It only leaves bad memories, remember? It's like, no, no, they said don't leave me. Because I'm pretty sure a lot. Because he said, <laughs> new. He doesn't recognize Queen in the last book, but he doesn't. I don't know, man. And let's see. Okay, so let's get to the most long, drug, dragged out, convoluted story of how Credence is not Credence, but is, but also not. No, he. And not that he's not Credence. That's his name. That's not his given name. He was just named Credence. Yeah. He was trying to figure out who he is mm. the entire movie. That's and also, why the. Did Grindelwald need Cre- for what? Why? I don't know. Did he need for him? For some reason, now Credence is very important. I, the first one was like, oh, cool, he's trying to get that power. But like, well, he's not. Nope. Now it's something else. It's his namesake. It's something else about him. That's why. It's like, but why? But why is any of this? Is he Lestrange? Yes, he is. He's Corpse Lestrange, the long lost brother. No, he's not because I killed him. Okay, cool. Then who is he? He apparently, he's a Dumbledore. Excellent. I, uh, hey, let's let's do this. Let's do this more. You know what else I know that, know that now? Thank you for revealing this to me. You can just kept him an uh, uh, out, uh, outlying character I knew nothing about. Now I know he's a Dumbledore, and I was like, well, and the other ones are only two Dumbledores left. I guess I. Well, I wonder what happens to Credence at the end of this, this franchise. I'm pretty sure he dies. <laughs> the Phoenix will reveal itself to you. Here's a Phoenix. <laughs> Wait, with what? You know what he said? Like a prophecy, like. A phoenix will reveal itself to a Dumbledore, Dumbledore in need, and he, the phoenix there's like he's a Dumbledore, and I'm like, oh, well, I'm pretty right. sure he's gonna die. But whatever. So here's the thing, right? 
I knew this was in trouble. Well, whatever. But also when they went to Hogwarts and they had a flashback scene in Hogwarts, like, how do you have a flashback in your prequel series? <laughs> Isn't this the <laughs> flashback? <laughs> Why are we going further? No, no, no. It's, it's flashpoint. <sighs> I don't get it because uh, yeah, yeah, the flash is there. Also, how okay? The, the, I, I gotta say the makeup job is pretty good because mm-hmm. Ezra Miller in here it's a whole lot older than the Ezra Miller that's playing Kid Barry Allen. Well, here's the thing: because he didn't shave, he has some facial hair going. That's why. I swear the the, the hair it just makes you look old. The hair might have old, but he also had the facial hair going too. So if you like the other one, he's very clean shaven, very me 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 me. Yeah. Yeah, oh. even that uh, credence back then, like, you know, me, teenager, and whatnot. And now he's, it's, it looks like we went like maybe two years, he grew a beard, got a little bit more mature, got a little bit older, like freaking Harry and Hermione is wandering and apparating. He grew some facial hair because he couldn't shave. Like, good lord, you guys are getting old. The hair does work, it makes so, you look uh, older. Jelani, grow some hair. Shut up. Ugh, man. So, yeah, he's a Dumbledore, and that's a. Uh, Point, I guess I don't know. I didn't like that. I was like, so wait, wait, I thought there's only two Dumbledores. I think the sister. It was Albus, the other Dumbledore that we don't see until at the end or like Aberforth, Aberforth, and then the sister that died. The, between the battle, no, it was a battle between Albus Aberforth, her and Grindelwald. Grindelwald. No, and the thing is, no one knows who cast the spell that killed her. Mm. The Aberforth blames both of them. Grindelwald and Dumbledore, Dumbledore especially. Okay, but which is really weird now because apparently there's a blood pact that said those two couldn't fight each other. But it's like, dude, I didn't know what point that, they like. But that then, blood pact has been broken. No, but no, no, because it's not broken yet. Because it's not the, broken his sister's yet. already dead. Remember, I'm I'm said, just, his sister's dead in this movie. Remember, he said, "I had a sister." Remember, he says that to the people on the stage. Oh, like, so when did you fight Wait. them? <laughs> when did this breakup happen? Okay, so maybe that's I don't why know. they made the blood pet. I thought it was because they were... We'll never fight each other again. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was because they, they were... Lovers. Good lovers. They're happy. and <laughs> Sorry, I cannot myself. Yeah, you know, but a fan, I don't know. The, the, the movie's a movie. It's, it's also, a- I, I never even knew that freaking Albus... And uh, Grindelwald had a thing until yeah. like this, like you said, like uh, JK said this. It she was did it a while ago. This was long ago. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure all the freaking uh, what do they call them? What do they call them? Fujoshi's are uh, excited about that fact. Yeah. We're excited about that fact. <laughs> oh boy, this is a thing. Mm. What else can we pick at this movie? Uh, the freaking blue flaming dragons going around. Like Nicholas Flamel, everyone form a circle, put your wands in the air. Because he's an alchemist, see? That's what got the, the, the transmutation circle. That's what that was there. That's just an alchemy thing. That's not for anything for Harry Potter. That's just an alchemy thing for like that yeah. part. Oh. I was like, all right, cool. That, that, that's... I mean, effects-wise, I mean, the movie looks cool. I mean, the beasts look better. That's the thing. Oh, yeah. I was expecting a little bit more beasts, but, yeah. Can't... The story's not really about beasts. It's yeah, really it's, weird it's, that they decided to call this entire thing Fantastic Beast. That's the weird part about it. Yeah. Like, not a lot about them. <laughs> I literally, I was, <laughs> like, when I heard, okay, the <laughs> very first one, mm-hmm. that one, Jelani, zoom into that poster. I'm not zooming in. Movie anything. head? Nope. Movie head? Nope. Fantastic Beast. And where to find them? Collier, <laughs> continue your point. We don't have long. <laughs> <laughs> when they came out with the title Fantastic Beast and where to find them, and I heard there's going to be more of these. Yes. I was thinking, okay, so it's going to be Fantastic Beast. It is. And, and, and uh, you and, know, and the about ball. these Fantastic Beasts, we're just going to go, you know. Because you said it's, it's a book that was within the book itself. Just like how to find like, these things, like, like, like his, how to train them. Like his book is. His the, manual. They keep talking about the book he's going to, he's writing. That's the oh, book. Oh, writing. Yeah. And I was under the impression that it's like, okay, this, this is what this is. Was, well, that's why he wants to travel to keep doing research for his book. Yeah. That's the book he's writing. Yeah, I know. I, I thought the entire series was going to be about that the book. book. Him going to these exotic places, mm-hmm. finding these, these you know, common to rare and legendary, uh, almost uh, endangered species, and r- taking notes and whatnot. And he's like, oh, uh, you're the famous newt. We have a problem. And like, we got some poachers. And I don't know. That's something like that. 
Like seeing some, it, something like, like that. Like seeing Ma- the, I'm not that, that, that circus scene. Magical creatures. Let's imagine, if you will, a different movie. But it was that circus scene. But it's Newt going in there and rescuing those creatures that are clearly being abused. Yeah. That's something you're like. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Definitely have to watch. I'm like, yeah. That's what I was saying like the first time. And the, like what you I wanted that movie to be. It's like, yeah, let's go there. And you're like, nah. We're going to go into the Grindelwald and Dumbledore story. It's like, then call it something else. Oh. <laughs> don't. Don't wrap the Fantastic if, Beasts if, 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 they was going, if, if they was going to go this route, they should have just called it Newt Scamander and the Fantastic Beasts Breaks Loose. I don't know. Or something. Or something. I'm like, Fantastic Beasts is clearly something that should have been the subtitle for the first movie, not the actual title. Newt Scamander because and now... the Fantastic Beasts. Newt Scamander and the love triangle between... I mean, not the love triangle. The freaking... Ah! It, it's not even, it doesn't even deserve to be called Crimes of Grindelwald because it's... I mean, he does commit some murder. I just thought about, like, he commits some murder. Yeah, but I, 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 mean, I was ready for a montage of Grindelwald doing Grindelwald themes. You know, you know, I thought it was going to be a much more overbearing threat in the movie. He was just kind of... Yeah, I, 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 he wasn't. It, like, just don't... I would thought he was going to be the precursor of the one who should not be named before he even was even before well, he was even born. Well, he is. It, Voldemort is inspired by Grindelwald. Well, well yeah, but, but I, yeah. Thought, I thought we were going to see... <sighs> Next movie? I oh, don't know. But, but, despite all these flaws, I still enjoy the movie as a movie. No. It's a crappy movie, nonetheless. It is a crappy movie. You're correct. But I have fun looking at it. It's like, ooh, colors, flashing. Colors, a ooh. simple man with simple knees. <laughs> oh, so he doesn't like Transformers. I don't know why. You think he would? No, Transformers is a, is a, is a man, that's bottom barrel. The first one I, I was happy for. Like, okay, I, I I guess I can get behind this, and I was expecting for that to be the only one. But no, they got with the second one. I'm like, all right, I can't get into this one as much as I did for the first. Then the third one. All right. All right. We're not talking about just, Transformers. We're not doing we're, the Transformers. We're not. We're not, we're not. We're not. We're not doing the Transformers in review. Yet. No. <laughs> no. We're not. I'm no. Listen, sir. If the people demand it, call here. Don't demand for that. <laughs> Do it. I want misery loves company. <laughs> Um. Yeah. Hey, did you do you have like uh, like a template of what we's gonna be how we's gonna be doing these? No, like, just, well, just, wait, wait, template of what? Like whenever we do the, these, the uh, no, whenever we do these uh, reviews or like reacts and whatnot, you always have like a template of how we're gonna break things down. Like wait, the, in the review part. Yeah. No, you we're had just, in your we're, phone. We're, we're, we're just talking about this. We're just talking about the movie. What's that? Oh. We're talking about point. We're just talking about spoiler points in the movie, and then after that, we're gonna wrap it up. No, oh, well. well <laughs> Is there anything? Oh! <laughs> Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find It would have been a whole lot shorter. A much shorter movie, if you will. You mean The Crimes of Grindelwald? Or? No, no, no. The, the first one. Okay. If you could just, like... What was it? Accio Sniffler. Which, apparently, you can do now. He, he didn't in this one. But, hey, remember that scene when the freaking Sniffler was, like... Remember those in the, two... In the bank? Si- not, not only in the bank. In, in the remember bank? The jewelry in the jewelry store. store. <laughs> They're on their way. They have to find a dangerous one, but they see the Niffler. And there is a good five-minute scene dedicated to getting this thing out of the jewelry. Two jewelry stores. Two. There is something out there. A giant creature that can explode things with its horn. No, let's have this five-minute scene. <sighs> Accio Niffler. Apparently, that's just something you can do. He, he used it to help find something like a crime scene like a freaking he freaking there's a whole he went there. into like a magical Batman Arkham Knight detective's yeah. mode with some golden dust he had to sniff her because sniffer likes shiny shit and whatever I feel like and then once, once he was done with the sniffler they just were trying to do sniffer. and guess what it went right back into the briefcase it not only did it just come it's like oh just all from here all the way back into the briefcase closed and shut and I swear that Niffler keeps coming out. Um, ha, 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 did they make a toy of that thing yet? Did they? Did they make a toy of that? The Sniffler. I don't know. I'm, n- I'm pretty sure it's Niffler, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, I mean they, Niffler or whatever. Hey, I mean, I like, don't frick- think. I don't know. I don't think Star Wars that. had BB-8, and then freaking Last Jedi had the goddamn Porgs. This one has to be the Niffler. I think they were trying to do something with Nuke Scamander's character, so like the whole not choosing the side thing. Like not choosing the side is still choosing the side because you're just going to be tolerated, which means you're going to let. 
the bad stuff still happen. So essentially, you've as chosen long, a side. I'm guessing as long as so it's like, at the like, end, he says, like, I've chosen a side now. It's like, all right, cool. People have died, and this probably would have not happened if you would just said yes to them earlier because obviously bad guy is obviously bad guy in the back waiting for you not to take this job. Was that supposed to be a, a like, <gasps> he's bad? Because he's like, he walks out the shadows from the back of the room. Yes, he's a bad guy. How do you all not see he's bad guy? <laughs> Yeah, like, I, I was for, like, some, for I was some reason, like, it's like, I was like, I was like, do yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I feel like I should know this guy. You're saying there's still not the villain. <laughs> it's like, so I get the job? Hmm? It's like, it's by like, the way, you're not the villain. Not, come on now. Come on, really? They're not gonna like how, like, they're gonna like how, they're not gonna like hearing how I missed. I'm, I'm guessing he's freaking dead shot now. Who no, no, no. Is? It's not the, the fact that he killed some innocent person and not the person oh. they hired him to kill. The maid. No, they hired him to kill the fucking, um... Uh, Credence. Credence, yeah. The ministry did, at least. Mm-hmm. But, he but he didn't be, kill Credence. Yeah, he was supposed to hit the maid. Because uh, Grindelwald told him to kill the maid, so he doesn't get the information that he wants. So he's more frustrated and goes the path that he wants him to go. Ah, uh, that that was the whole point of that. And the guinea was there to be just be there, just to be there, just to, look, to be a pretty face. Pretty. And just listen, she's, she's a very attractive woman. But as like, give her something to do, or don't have that character in the movie. Don't do this whole Nagini was a human thing, because then that makes it much more weirder when she actually does eat humans. <laughs> she turned into a snake once, once, and that was it. That was it. That's the only time. Eventually, just because she went. because we call, call her because Nagini. Remember, she's the snake of Voldemort. Right there. That's why. I still like the movie though. I don't understand. <laughs> I'm a simple man. A simple man with simple needs. If it was flat, you would love Ready Player One then. <laughs> huh? You love Ready Player One then. Yeah, but remember? I, was, I, got, I, went, I keep thinking I went with Steven, not you. <laughs> Steven's the one who hasn't seen it. That's right. Because we were both there like, did no one ever think to go backwards on the racetrack? Did no one think that? But this is not Ready Player One in review. I think there's only there's only going to be one. Incorrect. There's going to be a sequel. What? <laughs> How? Why? I don't call her because Dude, it ended on a good note. Money. How much further can we go on that? Call her because of money. That's how. And it's like Transformers all over again. Like Pirates of the Caribbean all over again. You can't in you can't you, you no. can and they do. All the time. Ugh. I I don't know. I don't have much more to say about this. The <laughs> plot wise, I mean it's really all over the place and not written well I need her to get some help writing the next three. we got three more of these <laughs> you know what? I want to come out liking these movies I want to come out you know loving what? these you know movies what? it's gonna be just like the the first the, the Harry Potter it's not his, his it's thing. going because Collier the writing Sorcerer's Stone uh Chamber Secrets gonna mm-hmm. no the Prince Secrets. of Azkaban boom no that's not how that's gonna work yeah. Because David Yates is still directing all the other ones. He still hired... Apparently, David Yates just has a monopoly on the Wizarding World. He's going to write all... I mean, he's going to direct all these, and J.K. is going to write all the other ones. So it's going to be the same shit we've seen the first two times. Collier, they don't listen. They don't learn. I mean... Okay, maybe... No, maybe what if... This is like an opposite thing. Okay. For the Harry Potter one, I didn't get invested until Prince of Azkaban. Yeah. What if by this third one, I just lose all hope and interest? Oh, Christ. It'll be so <laughs> What if it gets so It'll be bad? so much better for me to not argue with you how these are bad movies. <laughs> <laughs> just defending them over and over again. I get you enjoy them. I can understand that. Enjoy them, yeah. They're not good. They're so bad. They're so bad. They're so bad. And when will... <laughs> I'm sorry. It's more like a long lost relative of Matt Murdock. I swear. No. Doesn't look at people. Just Matt. Matt oh, Matt Murdock. I thought you meant like just Eddie Redmayne was. Uh, oh no! Just like he. he even the way oh, he walks. All right. So here's the thing we're gonna do right now. It's not working. I'm pretty sure we're just we're just going in circles now. <laughs> I think we're done with this spoiler part. Yeah. So here's the thing. Uh huh. We are just... going to rank the villain, and that is Grindelwald again. A big non-threat the entire movie. <laughs> yeah. He does nothing. <laughs> he just puts some words in people's ears. Yeah. 
I mean, you can say that's, that's dangerous, too. It's like, yeah, but I, I mean, in a movie, I want to feel a little bit more threat from our villain. The crimes of Grindelwald should be, like, he's here to wreck some shit, and he doesn't kind of do that until, like, maybe the end, kind of, but not really. He just, he just kills some horrors. You're our best... Who the fuck was he talking... What the fuck is this? You're their best hope, Nicholas. I was like, Dumbledore is across the... the that's not that far. England is a deal that way direction. It is not that far. It's you like, just, like, apparate, and you get there, like, within a blink of an eye. can I to New York for some reason. I don't know why. Is it the distance? Where are the rules, Collier? Where are the rules in apparition? Why does it not look the same? You need to find is it, is your it, way. What if you were the black smoke you one? Could you go further? Go distance. If you were the black smoke one, can you go further? Or is it the circle one? That, what is the... Collier, explain to me <laughs> what's happening here. I don't know. So um, where, where are we putting them? Oh, I should read the list off. From By the way, top. I need to point out uh-huh. that this villain listing was an idea I had when we were going to when I went to the MCU in review, but we missed out on that opportunity because we uh, we didn't have our shit together at that point. Now we do, but the problem is, I was like, I still want to do it, and I'm stubborn, so I decided to do it here, which is why we have a lot of same repeat of villains here. But I don't care. So here it is. Here is the list, starting from number fuck. It's not, one, two, three. I need number. You need to number these. I do. Not only oh shit, there are ten of these goddamn films. <laughs> Number least to top. Number nine, we got Voldemort slash Nazi wizard, Death Hallows Part One. Number two, Professor Quirrell slash Vold. We got number three. <laughs> I mean, number <laughs> fucking duck. Number seven. <laughs> no, number them right now. Just, just number them real quick. We'll just no, cut no, to number it. seven, Grindelwald. Number six, Peter slash Dementors. Number five, Tom Riddle. That's Chamber Secrets. Number four, Dolores slash Vold. Uh, number <laughs> three, Voldemort, Death Eaters. Number two, Death, uh, Voldemort, Death Alice Part Two. Number one, Death Meat, Half Blood <laughs> Prince. <laughs> Where are we putting. Grindelwald? He wasn't really much of a. Like a um, shoot, probably. Who's bottom? Voldemort slash Nazi, what's your Death Alice Part One? Here's what I'm saying, right? I'm saying, I'm saying dead bottom. That's what I was thinking. Too. Absolutely okay. Like, like, like okay, maybe not dead bottom. But no, I mean, listen, no, but then because I saw, this, but then this, I saw the Nazi wizards that. are all. They at least do. They stuff. do something. They they chase them to that forest. And like that's something that's like all right, cool. That's a threatening thing. Like this one, this one's like if no, I'm really just taking the job, none of this would have happened. <laughs> just said yeah, cool. Can I travel again? Excellent. <laughs> yeah. So dead last. <laughs> dead last. Dead last. <laughs> Just, uh, you know, a uh, power preacher. Grindelwald is one never say. Crimes of... Uh, CO, General, uh, so number 10 is Grindelwald. Crimes of Grindelwald. Did I put CLG? Cog. Cog. Grindel Cog. There we go. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to rank the movies. All right, so once again... Bottom to top. I'm not saying the Harry Potter because that's a lot of me to be repeating. So Just, no, number nine, something. Chamber of Secrets. Number eight. <laughs> that's how numbers work, on Jelani. <laughs> number eight, Sorcerer's Stone. Number seven, Devil Hall's Part One. Number six. <laughs> Fantastic where to find them. Number five, Where the Phoenix. Number four, Death Hall's Part Two. Number three, Half Blood Prince. Number two, Prison Mask. Number one, Collider. I'm calling you out, Goblet of Fire. That's how that movie Suck Collider. Is. Whoa! No, I'm sure. If you want to screw have your me, list. Whoa. Okay, listen. If you guys want okay, to okay, no, okay, show okay. at any point, no, I'd okay. be glad to show you the. Okay, 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 okay. Let me, okay, let me uh, mm. that list. My opinion, not, not fat. It sucks. It, it really, really sucks. Goblet Fire should not be that low. Goblet Fire should never been that low. Goblet Fire should never been. Should never been. But, Fantastic. but fat. Fat. Oh, this is much better. Oh, all right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <laughs> so where are we putting Fantastic Beast: The Crime of Grindelwald? Fantastic Beasts and Cog. In the Crimes of Grindelwald. Cog. Where are we putting it? <sighs> Bottom three. Bottom three, I don't know. Well, actually, no. Where's... Mm, okay, no. Right up under where to find them. So, number... F- fourth from the top. See, here's now... I, I didn't like I it better than... It, okay. Here's what I'm afraid of now. What's the matter? Now we're at a point where I, in my opinion, I was like... 
I mean, Sorcerer's Stone's not bad, but it's like, it's a, but like the book, it's like, it's really much more, like, it's for the children. Mm-hmm. It's like, it's a children's book. Mm-hmm. Same with Chamber of Secrets. Chamber of Secrets just dull. <laughs> more. <laughs> now I'm like, oh no. There are now more, Cause now, in, in this opinion, my opinion, there are no more as many good as there are bad ones. <laughs> it's like, please don't. <laughs> You know, okay, I don't you want you to, to like draw a line in here. There is like, a line. It's where to find them. Where to find them? That's where the line is. <laughs> so you say under the first under uh, where to find them? Because like I All still right. I like where to find them a whole lot more than I did this one. But I still enjoy this one, but just not as much. I didn't. So I would just be comparing them as a separate group. But the other Harry Potter's from Order of the Phoenix and then up oh, that list is way better than this. And then you know. If I had to choose from the bottom of the list, my first pick would be Where to Find Them. I think I would watch Where to Find Them over this one. I don't know. Christ. I, I would watch. I would rather I would watch, watch either of them. I, I, would, I, would, I, I would rather watch this one than Sorcerer's Stone again. Or Chamber of Secrets. Nah, I would watch Sorcerer's Stone over it. Listen, Alan Rickman. He would. He acts or circles around any one of these movies. Oh. Mm, okay. No, just Alan Rickman okay, in no, general. I might just watch Sorcerer's Stone just for him. Yeah. I was like, listen, they're enjoyable. I was like, I can't think of anyone on in that it, either of those. Maybe Jacob a little from Fantastic Beasts, but like this one, it was annoying. But yeah, I, I recommend he's heads above and tails above everyone, just at all times. Fantastic actor. But yeah, all right. So the list stands. Uh, I'm not reading it all again because that's way too much. Fantastic Beast is number seven on our list out of ten. There are ten of these guys. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I'm not listening to them again. I told them where it was. It's no, you seven. just need to number those things now. Nah. Why? We're not coming back to this. No, I'm just saying it's like, no. We, we got mean? like, what, two, three more years before we have to do this again? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not remembering anything. <laughs> Whew. All right. So in that case, that would be it for now. But that would be it. We did the Wizarding World Review. The Wizarding World of Review. Good. That was our trial session. Trial? Yeah. For the real thing. You know what I'm talking about. Into you, into you, <laughs> in review. <laughs> also, I don't know what you guys noticed, but we saw Collier. I wore my. I know, and Collier, I'm going to point something out to you. Yeah. Now you've worn that shirt too. <laughs> he was going to run. Because we did that for the last one, which means you look like you don't wash your clothes. <laughs> I digress. I always make sure to wear a different shirt on each video. I'm pretty sure you wore that. Name. Oh, I know, but it wasn't the last one. I make sure I I think back like, what did I wear for the last shoot? I'm gonna change the shirt <laughs> every time. I know. I just wear it for the moment of, and if it happens to you know be back to back, then what ifs? I mean, you we we that. saw Fantastic Beasts, and we watched a Fantastic Beasts movie. What did say would be a fantastic movie? But <laughs> I wish they were. I really want them to be. Well, too bad they ain't. But they're still to me enjoyable to some degree. Flaws and all. Would not say you should go see this movie. But if you watch the spoiler part, hopefully you have. Well, actually, not hopefully. Maybe, yeah, actually, hopefully. I don't want you to be spoiled. I would rather you see the movie and then go through the pain of it than come to someone else and just be spoiled by it. Because I hate when people just watch spoiler reviews without seeing the movie. It's like, then what's the point? Yeah, because then, you, then the their impression is like, you're going to be looking for those. Yeah. Like, okay, yeah. I don't look at reviews before I go watch them. I, I don't look at reviews before I, I can see, I see I don't titles. Look. And I was like, yep, skip that. I don't want to want to read what you wrote with the title of it. Let's <laughs> get, past my, get past my feet, please. All right, that's it. Thanks for joining. And, you joining us. and uh, make sure to come back for the MTN review. That's starting up oh. in two weeks. <laughs> I'm calling. I get to watch great movies now. Wah. So much movie. We, we need to get back to games, man. We can play games too. Call you. You know how that helps? If you come back, we have to have a recording schedule again. <laughs> the reason we're only doing the movies, we can only do movies because, like, you're gone. <laughs> you did this. You did it. Anyway, that's it. Bye, guys. Peace. Um, spell, 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 spell. I don't know. They didn't say any. In this. They did it. My spell. But yeah, no. That's, Accio. Like, that's the only spell that I've heard. The only. That and expel Aramis. They have to make sure you know that was. We remember just Arm Duke, and it went to it. Which I guess now that one belongs to that guy. Remember when he tricked him into the. Uh, the he did say expel Aramis. Yes, and it went to him. It's like. So is that now his wand? I, this is why they shouldn't have done that. Because now it's like, Newt won't have... I, I don't care. Gone. Gone. <laughs> Spiller Ramos. <laughs>